Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to install the Brave browser on a Mac computer. So let's get started. First, go ahead and open up Safari. From there, go ahead and type in Brave browser. And then you're going to want to click on this link, the brave.com. Go ahead and click on it. So once that web page finishes downloading, go ahead and click on Download Brave for Mac OS. When this message pops up, go ahead and click on Allow to allow the download. Alright, and then go ahead and click on this icon here to show your downloads. And as you can see, the Brave browser.dmg file is downloading. So from here, I'm going to go ahead and speed up the video. Okay, so once that Brave browser.dmg finishes downloading, go ahead and double click on it. And it should verify and open that DMG file. So when this window opens up, Go ahead and drag the Brave browser icon into the Applications folder. And it should copy that browser into the Applications folder. Okay, so I'm going to close some windows here. So I'm going to close this one. Close out Safari since we don't need it. You won't need this Brave browser installer anymore, so go ahead and right click on it and select Eject Brave Browser. Then go to the Finder window, go to Applications, look for the Brave Browser icon, double click on it. Once this message pops up, go ahead and click on Open. For the Brave Browser notifications, I usually don't allow, but the choice is really up to you. And then hover over the Brave Browser icon in your dock, right click, go to Options, and select Keep in Dock for easier access. And then you can go through this little tour. So let's say I click on Let's Go. If you want to import your bookmarks and settings, that's where you can do it from here. I'm just going to skip that part and click Next. This part just says you can browse safely and sound with the Brave browser. I'm going to go ahead and click on Next. From here, you can go ahead and set your default search engine, and it says DuckDuckGo is the preferred way. For this, I'm just going to say DuckDuckGo and select Set Default. And if you want to enable Brave Rewards, you can, and this is where you would do it. For now, I'm just going to skip and click Done. Alright, and that's all there is to it. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, and if you found this to be helpful, please hit that subscribe button. Thank you!